So mga kameranda, on this video, pag-usapan natin ano nga ba ang Ethereum Shanghai Upgrade? Ano ang mga bagay na kailangan mo malaman? Pag-usapan natin this coming April 12 birthday ni Coach Miranda Mayer. Ang paparating na Ethereum Shanghai Upgrade ay dinisenyo upang bigyan ng access sa mga Ethereum holders ang in-stake nilang Ethereum way back 2 years ago for the first time na isa sa mga pinakamalaking pagbabago sa platform. Itong mga assets na ito have been allocated towards Ethereum Proof of Stake Beacon Chain. So the move will allow Ethereum holders to stake the tokens without locking them up indefinitely. Ito ay magiging napalaking update sa Ethereum ecosystem dahil mawawag wala na ang pangamba na while nakastake ang Ethereum nila ay maaaring itong mawala. Ano nga ba ang Ethereum Shanghai Upgrade? It's important to understand muna ano ba yung mga recent events at Ethereum para mas malaman natin kung ano ang Ethereum Shanghai Upgrade. Itong major upgrade na ito after all is yung pinaka culmination natin of what came before. Tandaan natin si Ethereum kasi isang network na dinesign to be scalable, programmable, secure and decentralized. Ito yung blockchain of choice for developers and ventures creating technology based on the change of how many industries will operate and how we will conduct our daily lives. Tandaan natin si Ethereum kasi ay nag-start as a proof of work mechanism pero nagsimula silang mag-move towards proof of stake with the launch of the Beacon Chain in December of 2020. Ito yung era kung saan yung Ethereum with the Beacon Chain coordinating user staking which is only possible on POS systems in Ethereum. The contract for the Beacon hit its target of 524,200 88 Ethereum a week before the launch. Ang staking kasi kameranda gives crypto holders a way of putting their assets to work and earning passive income without selling the assets. Similar to putting money in a high yield savings account. When someone deposits your funds, the bank will take the money and often lend it out. In return for locking up your money, the account will earn a small portion of the interest. Parang ganoon din ang staking. Nga pala kameranda, if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to click on like and subscribe so you're updated for everything about cryptocurrency, technical analysis, fundamentals, and these types of new knowledge for you in crypto. Maraming salamat! In September 2022, the Ethereum merge joined Ethereum POS Beacon Chain with the Ethereum mainnet to transition the Ethereum blockchain off the legacy proof-of-work system. Yung merge na ito gave birth into Ethereum 2.0. Ito yung bagong version of Ethereum that would lead to a 99.95% reduction in Ethereum's energy consumption consumption and the ability to further scale the ecosystem. Sa mga susunod na buwan, yung merge will go through many testnet checks before eventually being completed. However, isang malaking issue pa ang kailangan i-resolve, yung gas fees. The minimum amount of Ethereum required for staking to join the Beacon Chain was 32 Ethereum. Ang price ng Ethereum at the time was about $4,000. Yan ang equivalent to almost $128,000 as an entry point at ito ay beyond reach of many individuals. But at least it was the start of a more democratic proof-of-stake mechanism for Ethereum. At that time, Camerada, staking Ethereum couldn't be unstaked, which is why the Shanghai upgrade changes. This left users' Ethereum funds locked until they could be released. So yung pinaka-intention ng Shanghai hard fork is tanggalin yung worry na hindi mo na pwedeng makuha ang Ethereum mo just in case something happened on the blockchain. Some teams in crypto industry saw the opportunity to address this issue. Several projects in the space began working on a more accessible way to stake on Ethereum. Tawag dito ay liquid staking. Ito ay nag-allow sa mga individuals to contribute smaller amounts of Ethereum, receiving a token that represents their stake Ethereum value. This token can be traded freely and you can be used elsewhere and in that sense, ito ay liquid. Some of the most popular LSEs offered in the platforms are Lido, Coinbase, and Rocket Pool. Lido has especially been popular and accounts for the vast majority of the liquid stake Ethereum. So ngayon alam mo na history about Ethereum, itong Shanghai upgrade is actually a series of upgrades for the Ethereum network. Yung schedule nila is April 12 and was preceded by the Shandong Network Test or Testnet in 2022. Ang Shanghai hard fork is comprised of several upgrades. Pero yung pinaka-impactful nito will allow Ethereum stakers to remove both their stake Ethereum and the rewards accrued. This has long been sought by Ethereum users and the crypto community at large. This change is established in the EIP 4800 
98.95. Tandaan mo ha, 48.95. The Shanghai Upgrade also has several other proposals related to Ethereum Virtual Machine, Object Format or EOF na tinatawag na software component of all EVM compatible blockchains na naglalaman ng more than 120 operational codes that gives them the decentralized programmability to the network. However, the developers have said that if these cannot be implemented in the time, they will be postponing until a year later to avoid delaying the unstaking of Ethereum. It's quite interesting na EIP 4844 will not be available on the April 2023 release. Itong EIP 4844 ay isang proposal na nag introduce sa mga investors and developers sa tinatawag nating proto-dunk sharding. Ito ay nagsiset up ng highly anticipated sharding upgrade for Ethereum due in 2024. This proposal will increase scalability by sharding data which is the database partitioning technique used to enable platforms and process more transactions per second. So ito yung kumagang papataasin niya yung transactions per second from an average of 14 pa. Kaya, ano ang mga magabago in terms of the Ethereum Shanghai upgrade? Unang una, more than $17 million worth of Ethereum was staked after the Ethereum merge as of March 2023. So that likely means many individuals will want to unstake their Ethereum. However, merong cap of around 43,200 Ethereum per day for withdrawal amounts. That way, there won't be a large migration of validators out of the network. Hindi magiging surprising to see the price of Ethereum rise after a successful upgrade, Kameranda. This has happened in the past and so far, everything looks on track for the Shanghai hard fork. Unang una, trade at your own risk and always plan your trade. What does the future hold for Ethereum after the Shanghai hard fork? Ethereum future amounts for much more than its switch to proof of stake. The platform kasi wherein the developers have systematically analyzed the changes that the network needs, they're not crushing to alterations in an attempt to ensure that the everything is in place for successful upgrade. Allowing stakers access to their Ethereum will eliminate this concern about Ethereum for the crypto community. Mas magiging wala yung risk and anxiety nila. The development team can then turn its attention to something else even more important for Ethereum success. For example, the introduction of sharding. Tandaan natin that the Ethereum's scalability goals ultimately will determine if the network is gonna be a crypto of choice. Bottom line, Ethereum enthusiasts, Camerada like you and me, and the crypto market in general should welcome the changes welcoming the Shanghai upgrade. It's actually a relatively small step for the project, pero it paves way for more and many more adjustments to come in the future. For the crypto movement like us, itong Shanghai upgrade na ito will start as the major milestone for Ethereum, forever altering how it operates and giving staking users no access to their Ethereum assets. O ngayon, alam mo na, Camerata, ha? Maraming salamat nga pala sa mga nag-comment on our video, Arbitrum, Airdrop, Fed Issues, Coinbase, Wells Notice, and everything about crypto. Sina Jao, Just Do It. Then Mel Lazo, maraming salamat sa pagkikayat on liking the video. To uh, Marlon Flores, Mayan Lomboy, Angelo Flores, Future World na Team Replay daw siya, Elong Much, Kelvin Durante, and of course to Mayan Lomboy. Maraming salamat sa inyo, Kameranda. Subscribe, like, follow, and share. Sige na please, Kameranda.